What is going on everyone? Platinum Beast coming at you with yet another video. Today we're going to be talking about how to hunt for specific platinum pieces. What you should do, what are some good tips, things of that nature. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay guys, so you're stacking platinum and you're trying to go after a certain series, whether it's platinum eagles in the fractional form or the full ounce form, whether it's a foreign mints coin series such as the Queen's Beast or some other series, or whether it is simply just fractional coins from other mints as well such as the 125th ounce Philharmonic. So how do you go about searching for specific platinum coins? Well, first and foremost, the mintage on platinum coins we know is very, very low. So almost every coin that's put out there has a very low mintage. And once it sells out and once the years go by, it gets harder and harder to find, right? If you wanna find a backdated Silver Eagle, which this is a 2021, so you, this is not backdated, although this is the type one. If you wanna find a backdated silver eagle or gold eagle, you're gonna have a lot easier time than finding backdated platinum or older platinum coins and versions and things like that. So you're gonna to want to know these few tips for hunting specific pieces if you are on the hunt for specific platinum pieces because there's a few things you need to kind of do and keep in mind when searching for specific platinum rather than just whatever platinum you can find and I'm going to showcase those in this video. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over to the screen cam and I'm going to show you specifically what has helped me find specific pieces that I am on the hunt for and searching for. This is definitely more better suited for people who are sort of collecting platinum to an extent. I consider myself a stacker at the end of the day, but I do like to go after certain, you know, coin series and, and lines and dates and stuff like that. I do like to go after that because typically when I do find them, it's only a little bit more for me to satisfy that collector bug in me. So I go ahead with that. For instance, this Platinum Philharmonic is a 2021, right? Now, if you remember correctly, I got the 2020 last year and I got the 2018 last year. But I'm missing a couple, right? I'm missing the 2017 and 2019. And I'd like to get them just to kind of get those two out of the way so that each year that a new coin comes out, I can add the new one and just slowly collect the entire line of coins. So it's kind of fun thing to do and it kind of makes stacking a little bit more fun as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over to the screen cam and I'm going to show you some things that you need to be doing if you're on the hunt for specific pieces. This can also apply to gold and silver if you are more a gold and silver stacker. So you can do these things as well even if you don't quite stack platinum like that or collect platinum in that manner. So we're going to go over to the screen cam and I'll see y'all over there. Okay everyone, so I've got Atmex's website pulled up here and I'm going to show you the best way to go about making sure you are aware when a coin or specific platinum piece is available for you to purchase. So this can also apply to gold and silver, so keep that in mind as well. But for me, I am personally looking for the Platinum Lunar Ox. So we're going to search that, we're going to go down here, we're going to click on the coin. Obviously, they do not have it available for sale. However, I can click Alert Me, and I'm already logged into Amex, so if I just hit Save, it's going to send me an email when this coin becomes available. But I'm kind of bad about emails, so I'll go ahead and say Send Alert Me SMS Text, and I'll type in my number, which that's not my number, but Nevertheless, you can type in your phone number and you can click save and it will save 
your number and your account and it'll let you know when this coin becomes available. Now this is not exclusive to Atmex. You can over you can also do it over here on JM Bullion. Say you were looking for a specific piece from JM Bullion and say you want this Perth Emperor Penguin Platinum. So I click add in stock alert and it already adds it to my account which I am logged in as and you have been added to the in stock alert for this product you will see an email when the product is back in stock so that's a great way to go about searching for specific platinum pieces that you are on the hunt for now one last thing I want to mention is you can go over here to eBay and you can find yourself whatever it is that you are looking for we'll say platinum lunar ox and we'll see if they have any available and they don't have any available results matching fewer words so you just want to click save this search and the thing about this save this search feature is that when you save the search it's not only going to send you an email but if you have the eBay phone app, it should send you a notification on your phone saying, hey, we found something that matches your search description and it's for sale and we just wanna let you know that so that you can go and look at it, see the price they have it listed for and decide for yourself whether or not it is something that you want to pick up because you've been on the hunt for it for a while. So this is just a pro tip coming from someone who has been stacking platinum for a while and this has come in handy multiple times for multiple different specific coins I have been personally looking for. You may find this helpful as well if you are one who wants to pick up an entire series of coins but you missed out on a couple of the earlier dates or what have you. This is a great resource to use if you are so inclined. So. I just kind of wanted to share these tips with you guys. Definitely keep an eye on eBay. Definitely keep an eye on the dealer's websites for pieces you may be looking for because you never know when something's going to pop up, whether it's from an online deal dealer or from simply just eBay and someone selling it that has it. So with all that being said, everyone, I appreciate everyone for stopping by and checking out the video today. Be sure to hit the like button down below. Hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date with future updates on my channel. Leave me a comment in the comment section down below. Have you ever used these types of alerts, whether on eBay, whether on bullion dealers, to pick up specific pieces for your collection? Let me know all that in the comment section down below. And until next time, guys, we will see you.